Ben Rico, a 90-year-old war vet's fight to fly his flag may be over. Colleen Riley following this developing story for us. Colleen? Kurt, late today, a spokesman for U.S. Senator Mark Warner says the Sussex Square Homeowners Association has dropped its request that the colonel remove his flagpole by Friday. The association released a statement saying it has agreed to withdraw its previous threat to file legal action against retired Army Colonel Vanty Barfoot. The association had threatened to take the 90-year-old Medal of Honor recipient to court if he didn't take down the 21-foot pole it is in Rico home. The pole violated the neighborhood's aesthetic guidelines. The story caught the entire nation's attention, including the White House. News that the colonel can apparently keep his flagpole spread quickly tonight near his Henrico neighborhood. I'm very excited about it. It's the fact that, you know, he served our country and, and uh, he's a war veteran and it's, it's well earned. Uh, so the fact that it, it would have been a, it would have been a uh, disgrace to him and, and our, our country uh, if, uh, you know, it didn't, it didn't fall through like that. Tonight we spoke with the attorney representing Colonel Barfoot and he told us that they plan to talk about this decision tomorrow. Also because of this story, Congressman Eric Cantor and Howard McKeon introduced a resolution in the House of Representatives today that would allow Congressional Medal of Honor recipients to properly display the U.S. flag on their property at all times. We'll let you know what happens with that. I'm Colleen Riley, NBC 12.